Edik Bear has a challenge called uh, Get It Painted uh, this summer and uh, yeah you pretty much take your miniature and uh, try to paint it up um, no time limit and you just um, post it on the Google Plus side Get It Painted, Edik Bear has set it up I'm going to draw links below um, so yeah, join up if you have a miniature and you don't have to make a video of it you can just uh, do the Google Plus side if you don't like to film or uh, have your speaking, um, you know, <laughs> your, um, yeah, making an ass of yourself on uh, YouTube like I, I, I'm doing. <laughs> Alright, my plan, um, this is pre appreciated, uh, you know, celebration of uh, Chaos Dwarf uh, getting War Scrolls on Age of Sigmar. I'm going to paint off Tarruk. Uh, it's a, uh, it's a, uh, Bold Centaur. Uh, this one you had to have um, three uh, Bull uh, Centaur renders to play with uh, the hero character. With the War Scrolls you have not. Uh, you can play just with him. So uh, hooray! Uh, I just bought it because it looked really cool. Um, I really want the renders as, as well but uh, this will be a really good start. So I'm um, just going to uh, show you how I think um, you see the skin of this dude. I'm going to try uh, with uh, burnt umber and um, mix in with uh, saddle brown as the two um, tones in all the rivets and uh, build up with um, khaki brown and uh, brown sand uh, on the highlights. Um, I'm going to try to paint uh, these uh, nails as well really good try to pay uh, close attention to everything dead heads, I'm going to try to find out the color that works with that so I, I think this will look really nice and I'm going to uh, use um, this one to tie it all together a shade called uh, Rackland Flesh Shade and probably go over with brown sand on the um, on the really tops to make it pop uh, yeah, so that's my thoughts about the skin on this uh, bull Kentaur. I'm probably going to focus on the brighter colors uh, on top and not so much on the bottoms to m make you pay attention to the upper body parts of him. Look at that muscles he has working on the gyms as well. Uh, on all metal you see here, on top I'm going to try uh, to put on uh, Vallejo liquid silver and on the bottom um, as well as on the top put uh, liquid uh, gold Vallejo and uh, I find uh, this silver to shine through the gold somewhat so this will be a natural highlight uh, on everything so I'm trying to just uh, make some steps and probably going to put some wash in the rivets, uh, in, in you know, between everything here to make it pop as they say. I'm, go I'm not sure how I'm going to do this. Uh, maybe red or uh, green or black, I'm not sure yet. I'm going to have to think about it. But uh, I'm going to start with the skin and I think for the base I'm probably going to try to use this kind of base. Um, um, I have to somewhat try to get this flyer stand off. I have used plastic glue on it. It's a pain in the ass to get off. I don't know how I'm going to do it. So I have probably going to have to go on eBay to buy one, because with H of Sigmar the bases don't uh, don't uh, matter anymore. So you can put more um, silic base on the table, and that's awesome. So I'm going to try. Try and do that. We will see. Uh, so yeah, th this is my plan for uh, how I'm going to do the uh, this ball center uh, to rock, uh, and uh, it's just a fantastic miniature. Uh, it's really good details, and uh, I'm I'm a bit afraid to put paint on it to be. To be perfectly honest with you, because uh, yeah, I'm probably going to fuck him up.
but uh, yeah, we will see. I'm going to try. Um, it's fun anyways to paint and I probably can paint in another time if I'm just painting really, really, let's see, uh, really thin layers. So, here you can see the bull cantors and uh, worshippers. And on the other side you can see um, bull cantors and slaves. Really cool detail. Ornate uh, metal plates. And of course uh, Chaos Dwarf runes here. The dreads the, that are uh, known for Chaos Dwarfs. So, um, and even some uh, cool looking thing here. A dead head of a Chaos Dwarf. <laughs> um, yeah, I really wrote lots of details, even dwarfs that are hanging on his trophy. And uh, yeah, really cool, really good looking. Even underneath, you can see details. So yeah, mm, watch the others, uh, go to Google Plus side for uh, more detail on this project and uh, yeah, thank you for your time, bye now and i see you later.